It is something special every time. And we've done it hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of times. And it's still special every time. I love seeing Claude's face and I love playing. I love it. My hardcore inspiration came off the streets of Indianapolis hearing the music played live. And that's probably where I fell in love with taverns. And I still love to play in taverns and bars. I'm intimidated if I don't hear somebody screaming or cash register or give me a beer. This is America's most original art form. It's totally American. It's right down to the core. My mother had a lot of piano records. My favorite was Fats Waller, and so on. That was the tune, except he played it faster and a lot better. My mother played piano, and I always thought it was so neat that she played the piano for a living. I just thought that was the best. I was always interested in jazz. My mother had me taking classical lessons till I was about 17. In the back of my mind, it was always the jazz. I had played a few jobs with him on a big band, Jim Edison's big band. I knew most of the guys on the band, and I looked down there once, and I saw this little guy sitting down there playing, who I didn't know. And then he stood up, and he took a great solo. We started playing jam sessions together at Claude's house. We lived together for a little bit, just across the street. And that was a time when I was practicing quite a bit. Claude, I think, probably drove him nuts. But. You want to be original, have your own sound or your own style. comes in it just comes out of the moment and evolves from the moment you start to make the sound and then and then it's sound tracing it's like tracing I'm so lucky you know I've been able to do what I want to do all my life and 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 have something to do that I love to do and uh, what else is there anything more re rewarding than that <laughs>